Hi guys, what we're going to be cooking today is my version of a beautiful Cuban sandwich. Cuban sandwiches, absolutely love them. Uh, first thing we're going to do, we're going to make the mojo sauce, the garlic sauce. So I'm going to chop up some garlic. So chop up your garlic. I'm using about six cloves of garlic for this. Now once your garlic's chopped, touch your salt, and roughly with your knife, just mince it. Beautiful. Okay, mojo sauce. Very simple, but very tasty. So add olive oil in. Once your oil is hot, add your garlic. And you just want to cook for about a minute, just to flavor that oil. Next, add orange juice in. Add in your lime juice in, then add your cumin, and give everything a good stir and bring it up to a boil and boil for about three to two minutes. Now take it off the heat and season, a little bit of salt, a little bit of pepper, give it a stir, let's taste it. Mmm, perfect. Now let that cool and also what I like to do is I like to put some thinly sliced onions in the sauce. Mmm, beautiful. Now let's give it a mix. And also for this sandwich, we're going to be using some beautiful pork tenderloin, the most tender part of the pig. And uh, for me, a Cuban, it's all about the meat. And also, especially in tenderloins, there's a lot of silver skin. So make sure that you remove it. That never gets tender. So what we're going to do, we're going to marinate this pork tenderloin. And I've got one of these food storage bags. And I'm going to marinate it in that. So put the tenderloin in the bag. Now carefully add in the sauce. Now give the meat a good massage, get everything in there. Now we're going to marinate this for about six hours. Look at that beauty. That's been marinating now for six hours, packed with flavour. I'm just going to sear it. Okay, hot pan, add in your meat. So put the meat into a roasting tray. Now just pour all that beautiful sauce over. Okay, as you can see, I've taken the meat out 150-ish internal temperature, and by doing this, this will make the meat more moist. So put the meat on a plate and let that rest. And look at this beautiful goodness. Don't throw that away. We're gonna use that as a dip. It's fantastic. And also, some beautiful dry-cured salami. Now look at that guys, absolutely fantastic. Now that is what I call a sandwich. So there you have it guys, that's my Cuban sandwich uh, with a mojo dip, absolutely fantastic. Can't wait to tuck in. Right, let's have a taste of this. Mm, look at that, beautiful. Mm. Just trying a bit of that dip. Mm. That is gorgeous. Mm. Gorgeous. Well, thanks for watching, guys, and give it a try. Thanks, guys.